Well, hello folks, and welcome back to day number two of the High Plains Regional Finals here in Loveland, Colorado. A beautiful day. We had a cooling rain last night. Man, it is good stuff. And we start off the day with a number 12 shootout where the champions took home over $12,000. We awarded out $36,000 in the entire rope and Martin Trophy saddles to the champions. Let's find out who they are as we recap the short round. We're gonna start with the 11th high team back. It is Wyatt Tarver and his partner, James Tarver. These guys are 30-89 coming to the short round. Now, if they can rope this steer in 948 or better, they'll go to the lead. Look at this. Wyatt gets out great on the steer, gets him caught, moves him out, and look at this. Two feet. They are clean right here with a 667. Jumping to the top, they lead the fast time out of the short round and the average 37 and 56. We'll go to the sixth high team back. Levi Britton, his partner, Tyson Holden. Now, these guys are 27 13 montana and wyoming tyson now lives in texas they've got to catch this one in a 10 42 to go to the lead levi gets him caught on the head side tyson puts it down there but comes up with one hind leg so a plus five they're 12 and 91 puts them at 40 04 and they are second at the moment We'll break down the top three now as it's the third high team back, Clay Corzine, his partner's Kind Kreutzer. Now they're 2467. They've got to be 1289 right here, so some time to play with. Clay gets it on him and moves him out. Kind comes in there. They're going to be at 12 and 58, including the penalty. 37 25. However, they do go to the lead of the rope and they are guaranteed $6,498. The second high team back, Kyle Rush, Pake Younger. These guys out of Grand Junction, Colorado. They're 2320. They're from the other side of the mountain. They got to be a 1404 to go to the lead. And Kyle gets him caught right here. Moves him out. Pate comes in 865. They are 3185. And they're now first with one to sweat. It's the high team back. It is Mike Robinson and his partner, Gary Rodimo. Now these guys are 2101. A 1083 is all they need to do to win $12,312. Mike gets out on the steer and Gary two feet right here, 693. They're 2794 and they go out with a bang. They take the top honors. $12,312 is going in their pockets and then the beautiful Martin Trophy saddles as well. Let's catch up with a chance and see what they have to say about the big win of the 12th shootout. Mike, you just won over $12,000, brand new saddles. What's going through your head right now? Uh, pretty happy, to be honest with you. It's been a kind of a rough summer. I've uh, been pretty busy and, and Gary's kind of moved over to the mountain, so I haven't been able to rope with him that much. So uh, decided with, to come up here. We weren't gonna rope up here and he decided to, so it was kind of a last moment deal. It's kind of exciting. I don't blame you. Well, you said it's been a rough summer, so coming into this rope, and what did you want to do different? Uh, you know, just kind of go back to the basics, just catch. That's our big thing, is just trying to catch and slow everything down. We kind of struggled earlier this summer, and so we just kind of slow things down when we practice, and so that's what we were trying to accomplish here once we got here, to kind of slow things down. Well, you said he moved over the mountain, so you haven't got to practice as much. What, is, what kind of difference does that make coming here when you haven't been practicing together? Um, I'm not worried about Gary, to be honest. It's me. So Gary takes care of him. He makes me look good. So I just, I, I just been focusing on myself pretty much, you know. I, I don't worry about him. Well, you guys roped great. Congratulations on your win. Good job. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Okay, Gary, it took a lot to get you to smile after you just won over $12,000. Tell me about that. Oh, I just been trying not to beat myself all day and, um, and I we have plus five, just don't want to show too much emotion, I guess. Well, you guys, I was told by your partner that you weren't going to rope here initially. What made you decide to rope together here? Well, I'm a team roping producer on the western slope of Colorado and we got so much rain that I got to cancel my ropings for today. So I stayed home, stayed over here last night and we entered, the, we entered yesterday for the 12 roping. So that's goodness you weren't even going to rope at all you just last minute decided yes ma'am well tell me about roping with your partner uh, I've known Mike for quite a while we done some good at the winter championships in Denver eight or nine years ago and then we've had a pretty good dry spell since till now so 
it's a good way to break it. Well, what about roping here at the original roping? Is there any extra nerves? Uh, no. I mean, I just try to think of every one of them as a rope each deer for what he is and not think ahead. Well, have you ever won a U.S. saddle before? Yeah, I won in 06. I win like six of them. So. so this is a good way to have 2014, huh? Yeah, but I've never won a regional saddle. Well, you've got one now. Congratulations and great roping. Thank you very much. Well, again, a congratulations goes out to the champions, all the champions out of the 12 shootout, $36,000 awarded out right there. Congratulations. Stay tuned right here to the final spin because we've got more coverage from the Gold Plus where we've added $20,000 to that Gold Plus here at the High Plains Regional Finals. We'll be back. Thank you.